Alrighty guys, I'm out here at the uh, camper. This is a uh, 2015 StarCraft Autumn Ridge 309 BHS. It's a 2015 model. And uh, today we're going to be getting some new tires. Uh, as many of you guys know, they have RVs or uh, travel trailers uh, and fifth wheels. The tires that come from factory are not the greatest. Uh, we've lucked out and had these for about three years. I just looked at the date code on these, which if you guys don't know what that is, let me see if I can find on this side. It is going to be inside of a square. And now I can't find it on this side. Uh, on the other side, I can find it really easy. And for whatever reason, up there it is. Um, this one is two. Four of I can't be 12 I hope not or 43 of 12 I hope that's not right let me see if I can find this one this one okay so it's 41 of 2014 I don't know if you guys see that it's right here uh, but that's the date code there so it was made the 41st week of 2014 so all these tires are 2014 as I checked the other side they were 14 as well so uh, it's 2019, and we're going on, what is that, four years, five years? Um, so definitely don't want to keep the uh, uh, the chance of having a blowout. So this has been in storage for about a year. I've got the uh, nasty black lines that many of you guys dealt with. Uh, I've got to wash this unit, get it detailed. But overall, it's been a great unit. No complaints, no major issues. So let me go ahead and... Uh, get this thing on the road and I'll show you guys what it looks like uh, with the new tires you guys will see what we went with all right I wanted to show you guys real quick real quick wow real quick this trailer uh, with this truck alone has had uh, 1400 uh, and 2.8 miles uh, so that's 1400 miles on those tires we took this unit to uh, Georgia just outside of Atlanta so that just shows you how many miles we've, we've gotten on those stock wheels. So, all right, on the road we go. Alrighty, guys. So, uh, shop just wrapped up. The tires look great. The uh, Goodyear Endurance is what I decided to go with. Uh, went with the 225, uh, 15, same size tire. Uh, I believe it's more than likely going to be inflated in a max pressure of 80. Uh, he may have done 70 or 75, but uh, it tells you right on the uh, sidewall max inflation is 80. So we'll keep it probably 70, 75. Um, reviews are pretty good with uh, Florida RV. Uh, the Facebook page, a lot of people are going to these, so I decided to go with these. Um, even the tire guys were, were like, yeah, <laughs> these are a whole lot better than what you have on there or what you had on there. So, um, so they look good. Uh, I've got a little bit of an issue, as many people have uh, storage. Looks like I had a uh, squirrel or probably even a mouse or something got up in there and chewed at the uh, marker light here. So I'm going to have to get that fixed. Fort Wilderness, holla. Oh, also get the bird uh, nest every now and again but here's the other side same thing looks good uh, very happy to have spent the money uh, came out to right around 600 bucks uh, install um, taxes and everything so about 600 dollars so very happy tire kingdom shout out to you guys at uh, alfa and 50 in orlando these guys are great uh, they were extremely busy, but uh, were willing to take me in to get this done. Got the uh, coolant done on my truck, as well as my rear brake job on my truck. So, uh, Tire Kingdom, those guys are great. And uh, LFA and 50 in Orlando. So, check them out. Hope you guys like this video. Subscribe, and we'll catch you in the next one.